All right, hello, this is Chris Evans, and this is my reassessment for the work energy reassessment, our assessment that we did in class last Monday, I guess. All right, um, um, or last Wednesday, I'm sorry. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Uh, so uh, the problem's in the email, of course, about the two uh, two mules pulling um, pulling the barge along or something. And um, so anyway, the, it's um, pretty basic. I mean, the formula that we use is the work equals force times the change in the um, distance times cosine of theta. Okay, and what we know is we know that there's two mules, so we're not, we're gonna have to so we have to find the um, the total work done by both mules, and uh, so we're gonna have to double the final answer. Um, we know that theta is 45 degrees, and we know that the force is a thousand newtons or 1.0 it's 1.0 kilonewtons, but a thousand newtons, and we know that the distance is 150 meters total. And also, it says something about the weight in there. We know the weight. I mean, the weight of the, um, their um, barge, whatever, has nothing to do with anything that is important. So, um, I mean, for define work. I mean, all that we need is the force, the um, distance, and the co and the angle. So, um, just plug in the values. So we get work equals 1,000 joules times 150 is the distance, and then take cosine of 45 degrees, and we get, and for that, get 1.1 times 10 to the fifth joules times two. Good way to multiply that answer by two because there's two mules, and each mule each mule does 1.1 times 10 to the 5th joules. And we um, total amount of joules, the work done is 2.1 times 10 to the 5th joules, or if you, and, um, kilo, kilojoules, because it gave us the kilojoules, and so then, um, or uh, it gave us kilonewtons, but uh, kilojoules is 212 kilojoules, or 2.1 times 10 to the 5th joules. Yeah, that's about it, that's my work energy reassessment, and um, that's how I did the problem. Thank you very much and have a great day.